Yeah, you know, that's a great analogy. Every year, I think uh, there is excitement, just like there is for uh, for kids in the first day of school. The only thing is, a lot of times my kids weren't looking forward to that day. I am looking forward to, to this. I'm excited to get going for, for probably the last week or so. I've just really wanted to get to tomorrow and get out on the court with guys. So, uh, yeah, I'm excited. What's the Rudy Jackson status? I know you told me, uh, I think it was earlier this month, that not uh, no tour days, but he can at least practice one time a day? Correct. That's where he is. So um, he, he's a, he can go once a day. Um, he did play some uh, five on five with our guys at the end of last week. Um, you know, and, and we're just, just trying to decide, you know, which practice and how much and how to bring him along. I, I think he would agree, but you can ask him that, you know, really the biggest issue right now is conditioning. You know, as you would expect, he's in the shape of someone who hasn't played in six months. So um, conditioning is uh, an issue for him. And we've got to approach that of, of getting him back in game shape without overly pounding on his, uh, on his legs. Is there anybody else, Stan, that has any limitations going on? Yeah, um, Langston, you know, hasn't done anything with us. Well, he has. Hasn't done any contact work. It, it, it's funny with him. He had had a uh, bone bruise in his knee in August, and so they had him off of it for three or four weeks, and he felt great after that. But the uh, but the bone bruise, by looking at the MRI, hadn't healed. So they've held him out of September. Uh, but he's cleared to go now, but again, hasn't done anything in a long time and trying to reduce inflammation in the, in the knee. So, you know, John and I talked about some things today and he's still thinking about some things, but we got to find a way to, to sort of um, ease him into it a little bit too. I mean, he won't just be all out. And then Andre sprained an ankle at the end of uh, last week, Thursday maybe. Um, you know, one-on-one -on -one thing with uh, Eric Moreland landed wrong. No major damage. Um, planning to go at, at least in the morning in the non-contact practice tomorrow. Uh, don't know if he'll be available for the first couple days uh, when we go five-on-five five at night. Those would be the three guys that are, uh, are uh, limited a little bit.